Do you want to know the top five spring denim jean trends you should have in your wardrobe? If you do, then stay tuned. Hi guys, my name is Jazz and welcome back to my channel here where I discuss everything fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So today I'm going to be talking about jeans and the jean trends that you actually need in your wardrobe for spring. So I know spring for all of us has been like a really just like just an awful start, but you know hopefully we'll get there, we'll be outside soon, and these are the jeans you need to have so when we are able to go out you have them. Um, so for me when I'm looking for jeans, I'm pretty tall, I'm like 5'7", even though it's not tall tall, but it's tall enough. Um, I'm always looking for great lengths. Um, great fits but most of like really just jeans that are transferable that I can wear from day to night to work to out and whenever so these trends that I'm going to show you today actually can do all of that and they're super affordable um, which is most important so stay tuned so I can show you all the looks that I found and how to actually style them so the first style of jean I'm going to talk about is the mom jean. Now the mom jeans have been out for some time but I love them because even if we go skip to three years ahead from now they still will be in style and they're like easy to wear. You can literally wear them however you want. You can wear them with a t-shirt, you can wear them with a top like I have on now, you can wear them with a crop top, you can wear them with a sweater. Literally there's no wrong way to wear it and I like it because it's the most relaxed fit and even if you want to dress it up it's still relaxed without being like sloppy. Um, and I like them too because my favorite brand to actually buy for um, mom jeans is either Topshop or American Eagle. But what's great about them is like the ones I have on now which you'll see um, right here is that they are you can wear them tighter so you have like a mom jean that's a little tighter on the hips but you can also wear them like really loose and have that kind of boyfriend feel but still getting support on the waist and Topshop I love them so all my tall girls like Topshop if you get your jeans from there whether you can get them from Nordstrom or Topshop's website they come in lengths so you can get them 30 or 32 and I think they have 34. I go for the 32 length which helps and the 30 is too short and also American Eagle has lengths as well. So the next pair of jeans I'm going to show you guys is a slouchy fit. So the slouchy jean I actually get from Zara and I love them. I have like two pairs of them. Now I find this jean to kind of be the trickiest to style and not for me so much because I kind of just wear them with like a longer tee and just tuck it in the waist. Um, or wear like a white t-shirt with it. I've worn a blazer with it. There's tons of ways you can wear it with. And I'll show you guys like a blazer option too. But I think people don't like this fit only because it has like, it's like almost balloons at like the hips and people feel like it's kind of odd. But I say just try it no matter what size you are. Just go a size up um, only because I like it to be loose. Otherwise, if they're too tight um, around the thigh, it looks a little weird. Um, but right now I'm wearing like an old Zara top, but it's just tucked in the pants. And you'll see um, right here, that the pant actually like balloons at the legs a little bit um, and they're a little cropped at the ankle but you can wear them with a white t-shirt you can wear them oh sweat like if it's cropped I would like it to be cropped a little higher unless it like tucks in sometimes if the shirt is too long it can just look odd so I like um, options on the top that are either tucked or cropped um, but you can also wear a blazer with which I'll show you or you leather jacket so I have my leather jacket here leather jacket and I'll show you guys different ways but you can even pop on a blazer with it as well so let me show you guys so the next style of jean I'm going to talk about is the kick flare or crop flare I like I like crop flare that name better kick flare sounds like I don't know I don't like that name but crop flare um so the pair I have on is white um and for spring I definitely recommend getting a white pair of denim only because you can wear it so many different ways with any color top and it just gives like a nice soft spring um feel um these are Zara um they're really nice because they're high-waisted and they're really stretchy so it like it gives me like it makes it just hugs like so nice um but right now I'm still wearing it with the um this is a last year's our top like tucked in but i'm gonna show you how you can wear it with like a t-shirt um or even like i'm wearing a lot of my slides in there because they're just so easy if you don't have a pair of slides for spring get one um get a pair because they're just so easy and it's a good way to have a heel without um it being too high but anyways um this is styled with this um i'll show you with it with a t-shirt and like a blazer um, but you can also wear like a tank top or anything cropped would be nice because the top is really high. 
So the next pair of jeans I'm going to talk about are from Zara. They are the 90s high rise wide leg um, jean. So when I first got these jeans I was like oh my god they're going to be so long and I'm 5'7 and they're long on me. So if you're a little bit shorter under 5'7 I would probably go with the crop kick flare to get the same kind of feel because um, they are long. Like these like all the other options I showed you guys like you can probably wear with like a flat shoe or like something really low heel. Like these you can't wear with anything like lower than three inches like they're that long. Um, so even if you're 5'6 and you want to get them tailored and cut or you can cut them straight across because the hem um, you can cut them you can do that too um, but they're high rise um, super long I love these jeans so these jeans like usually because they're like the highest that I've probably tried um, everything I wear with it is honestly cropped even this t-shirt like I just tied it to the front just to give some shape um, to the pants um, anything longer and then like a longer like wire leg will make it look sloppy so anything cropped you can wear like a cropped sweater um, if you have like a t-shirt or shirt you can like tuck it in but more so like the kind of tuck in vibe or crop um, vibe will go with this pair of jeans but I love them. So the last pair of denim jeans I recommend is of course a high waisted good fitting skinny. So my favorite skinny jeans either come from Topshop um, or American Eagle because they have like really great lengths and really amazing stretch. So if you're curvier the stretch in Topshop or American Eagle is great. American Eagle is even better because they have um they always have a sale so either you can get buy one get one and for some reason their jeans online tend to always be cheaper than in store um for american eagle the curve the fit that i recommend is the curvy jegging so the curvy jegging has a making amazing stretch and get them in black or like a really good light pair the pair i have on here is um Top Shop and these are the Jamie Jean. So a great thing about Top Shop, you can get them in different lengths. I always go with the 32 because they tend to be perfect, but they go up to a 34 length. So that is everything from my spring trend denim haul. Um, let me know what you guys' favorite trend was and which one you're most excited about trying. Um, I put everything in the description box. If there's a style that is sold out, I put a replacement of an alternative that is very similar. Um, be sure to like this video and please subscribe because there will be more. And I hope you guys, I wish you guys are safe and well and I will see you guys next time. Bye.